everybody rally here for another episode of fish keeping jamaica welcome to my channel okay so today is another share in a series uh culture in your own your very very own live fish food at home easy and simple now i live in the tropics and the tropics is known for the heat and rainfall now with the heat and the rainfall come what you call mosquitoes today we're going to be talking about the whole idea of getting mosquito larvae uh, within containers so as to feed your fish now uh, I live in Jamaica I live in rural section of Jamaica uh, some person said that I live in bush right okay so the thing is I have over 18 ponds uh, about four containers uh, six aquariums and another three aquariums to be installed very shortly now uh, whenever I am trying to get some fish species to actually breed I have to ensure that they, their um, level of fat and their level of protein intake ha um, increases so one sure way of doing that is by actually opening the nuts a little bit by creating opportunities for them to get both live food and to also get this additional fat and additional high protein that they need so as to you know be able to spawn or to give live birth so what I have been doing uh, over the past couple of weeks is to actually culture uh, mosquito larvae. Now, it's very easy to do. Now, the first thing that you need to do uh, for those persons living in climate that is very cold, this might be a little bit ticklish, you will have to do this in the summer when the time is very hot, right? Now, what I, need, what, what I did was to actually get a container filled with water, find a warm dark spot within the property within the house or with outside and actually put that container there let it stay there and you keep a check on it like every day or every other day now what mosquito love is mosquito love and um, condition where it is warm it also love condition where it, uh, where, where the place is dark and uh you know it it, it it doesn't like that water that is like for example tap water it's going to take a while before you actually get some mosquito larvae in tap water so what i tend to do is to um use my fish you know my my fish pond water so as to get the mosquito interested in laying their eggs in this water now after the mosquito have actually laid their eggs in this water i i wait a little bit until i see wrigglers as soon as i see wrigglers then now i will i won't really spend the time to take out the wrigglers what i would do is to actually um empty the entire container of water in a space where which the fish can actually um have the opportunity to chase these wrigglers uh whether it be for a small uh distance or for a long distance so as to actually exercise and to also get the nutritional intake that it actually needs to spawn to reproduce to remain healthy so uh, it's very easy to do um it's not something that i do on a regular basis uh but it's very easy for do so you can you can actually try it at home uh you know culturing mosquito larvae it's very dangerous though if you end up um allowing the larvae to actually um develop into mosquito now that's where you have a problem and your neighbors might just quarrel all right so the the the, 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 the essence of this video is to share with you that you can actually culture live fish food at home very simple very cheap how should i say it's it's just free it's free it's not cheap it's free right and uh, you just have to you know follow the steps and you should be in the wind with this uh very shortly thank you very much for stopping by uh catch you next time peace out bye bye